Okay, here we are on the laptop, which has never been in on the internet and never will be. Uh, I just plugged in the USB stick. Actually, you know, let's make this a little bit more obvious. How can I rename this? USB. Let's go in USB just so that we know this is the USB stick. So then what we're going to do now is so we're going to set up folder. We're going to open up our password file we've created and we're going to go in here and so the deposit um, file that's what we have to execute in order to do that we have to run um, the command line cmd so what you do is press windows key and r key together and then this run window comes up and there you type in cmd command line hit enter and then this pops up so let's uh, order this on the screen a bit <coughs> so this goes down here yeah and you go there okay so now we have to in this window we have to go into this folder here and we do that by first of all we're going we have to go to the um drive d so this is drive C, so we just type in D colon, so now we have drive D. And then we want to go into this folder here. So just, just copy this. Copy, and here you type CD, which is stand, uh, change directory. And then you just right click, and that pastes whatever is in the uh, buffer. Hit enter, so now you, you are in that um, directory here. And then and now you can uh, execute the deposit file. So let's execute that. Yeah, there you go. And it tells us, so do you want to create it from an existing mnemonic or a new mnemonic? You can use your hardware wallet mnemonic if you like. Um, but for this demonstration, I'll just go with a, a new mnemonic. So again, we type deposit new mnemonic. And it asks us which language this uh, should be in. Yeah, in English. And then we choose English. How many new validators? Well, just one, please. Um, so mainnet or testnet? I'm going to go for mainnet. But if you want to test it, then go for Prata. Create a password that secures your validator key stores. Right, okay, so now let's have a new section here. And let's go with validator. And here is a um, validator key store password. Right, you choose a different one, obviously. Make it secure. So I'm going over here and put it in there. Make me more secure. Repeat, make me more secure. That worked. So this is your mnemonic seed phrase. It's also called a seed phrase. Write it down and store it safely. It is the only way to retrieve your deposit. So these are the words. Uh, so I have to write them down again. Uh, down now. While I'm speeding this up by 800%, uh, so let me tell you that after this is all done, it probably is a good idea to create a copy of the USB stick because by then you have a lot of data on there which you don't want, uh, I don't know, accidentally to erase or, you know, break somehow or as an error, technical error in the USB. So make a copy of this USB stick before you continue. So. It has created our keystore files or is creating it at the moment. Success, excellent. And it puts those keys into a newly created folder. It's called validator keys. And it's here in, here you can see it in the Windows window. And inside there are two files. The deposit file is the one we're uploading to Launchpad. And it tells the Launchpad uh, how to associate the validator with our 32 ETH. And the keystore file is the one we're going to upload into the prison package.